downloaded your equations and I processed it into my hard drive. The roses are in the bucket, so if all goes well, this formula should keep them from aging, right? Technically, it should. But I still think you didn't use enough. What are you talking about? I have told Billy the exact amounts of everything. My plants are living for 40 times past their usual lifespan. So, Billy, you try it out. I don't know if I like the color she used. This is Donovan. That looks beautiful. And I love your hair. That style really suits you. You can call me mom. I already told you about that. All right. Here goes. I think this makes me look like one of those wanna-be young grandmas, does it? No, Mom. I, I don't. It is absolutely beautiful here, Mary. You picked a wonderful place to live, son. Yeah, Monique and I, we love it. Guys, you didn't say anything about smoke. Willie, the smoke will not harm you. It is just white. Odorless smoke. An indicator you use too much formula. Now you must stop it before you lose visibility in the room. Okay. Mom, this huh? um interest that you have in the way you look, it wouldn't have anything to do with dad coming into town, would it? The creature? Is Miss Thing staying at the house? If you mean mom, yes she is. Yes, see, that's on you. You could have told me that she was coming. I'd have rearranged my trip. So self-absorbed. Honestly, whenever that man looks into my eyes, the only thing he sees is himself. Oh, I mean, she is really something. She can be the biggest pain in the behind that I've ever seen. You know it. Are you going to be able to get through this? Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff. <sighs> oh. I'm waiting. Whatever you do, don't use water. Gosh. Well done, hair accreditation. Perhaps you should avoid the about this beforehand. No hair, you want to talk about hair. Oh, no, 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 no.
I think he's okay. Thanks, guys. Hey, kid. Don't play with the truck. Sit. What's your name, son? Will Smith. Now, let me guess. You were just getting jiggy with it in the garage? Now, your real name this time? This is my house. Excuse me, sir. Sir, you can't. Willie. Willie, are you okay, son? Yeah, but they messed up my experiment. False alarm. I'm sorry. What did you do? Hey, Grandpa. Come on, let's go assess the damage. Leave you two alone for half an hour, and this is what happens? Where's your sister? Sydney! Dad? Dad, what is this? Where have you been? What? I was upstairs, and all of a sudden, I see this smoke every... What did you do? What do you think? What? Oh. <laughs> oh. Hi, Grandpa. I am so sorry. I didn't even see There's you. There's my beautiful <laughs> granddaughter. <laughs> it is amazing. You are the spitting image of your grandma cat when she was your age. Of course, you're a lot more level-headed. <laughs> Thanks. I think. No, no, don't get me wrong. On the outside, she's still beautiful. <laughs> but sometimes the inside can affect the way you look on the outside. And your grandmother's insides are twisted and mauled and all around wrong. And the way her brain works, I mean, the logic she employs is like on another level altogether. Uh, Dad. What happened? Is everyone all right? Everyone's fine, Grandma. Mr. Einstein here was working on another one of his experiments. Oh, Willie. How many times have I told you to pay attention to what you're doing? Honey, you're playing with dangerous chemicals here. I thought I was being careful. No, you weren't. Now, until you learn to take much more responsibility, your lab equipment is off limits. Understood? Do you understand, young man? Yes, I understand. OK, let's get things cleaned out. What? What? Me? Oh, no. Uh-uh. I have to go. I mean, I'm already late for work. Why don't you let him do it? It was his fault. Wait, wait, wait. wait. You're going to come home early, though, right? I'm, I'm making a family dinner. Yeah, sure, sure. Just make sure there's no meat. I don't eat meat. I know. Bye, Dad. Bye. I'll make you something special. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Oh. Willie, what? Oh. Best you get the soapbox and bring it upstairs with me. Should I go now? I think it's best you do. We're not finished yet. You are grounded. Take it easy, Barry. <sighs> you gonna ignore me all week, Cat? How can I? You're in my face. No one asked you to come here this week, you know. Man can't even visit his own grandchildren. They're my grandchildren just as much as they are yours. Yep. Same old bitter woman. Looking at the same old selfish man.
for this burg. You don't know busy until you've seen the stores in L.A. That's busy. Ugh. Ah, uh, well, Brad says you're catching on fast. Hey, I'm from California. We do everything fast. <laughs> Sydney, look, I know you miss L.A., but there's a lot of cool things and people here, too. Mm. Yeah, come on, give it a chance. You'll see. I'm telling you, you can feel it. It's in the stars. Yeah, what I mean. Yeah, oh, yeah, I can feel it. The moon and Venus are aligning. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, I feel it. Strange <laughs> oh and wonderful God. things are going to take place. Oh, oh. What? Oh. Do you recognize him from computer class? Jumpin'. You can email me anytime, baby. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mm, 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 girl! <laughs> you must have wished upon a star because tonight is your luckiest night by far. Oh, please. Oh, so seriously, to the oh, girl who is so funny, how would you like to roll with Mr. Milk and Honey? Milk and Honey? Oh, yeah. Are you serious? <laughs> I do not joke. When it matters, not. You know what? Um, my shift's over. So I will see you later, okay? Call me Julie. Yeah, my name's Terrence, but that's cool. We'll get that later. So your friend, <laughs> and she seems to be taken with me. Oh, taken with you, is she? You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I'm talking about this, right here, like that, you know? Okay, mm. can I get a price check, please? What you doing here, kiddo? Oh, hey, Grandpa. What's up? Well, since I can't use my lab set anymore, I'm using my computer to do virtual experiments. Ooh, quite the little scientist, aren't we? A bad one, if you ask anyone around here. Oh, then I guess you won't be needing this. What is it? Open it up. Authentic scientist lab coat. Thanks, Grandpa. <laughs> That's for inspiration. You're a very talented young man, Willie. Once you're off your grounding, you can wear that thing, but not before, okay? And listen, you got the right attitude. You're young, you got your whole life ahead of you. You got plenty of time to do what you have to do, okay? And remember one thing. Grandpa loves you. Grandpa. I love you too. <sighs> Heavenly Father, we ask you to bless this food we are about to consume. Please help it to nourish our bodies to do thy will. And Father, we ask you for special blessings for Barry and his family and this wonderful, wonderful celebration that we're having right now, Father, for those who were invited and for those who were not invited. Some of us need more prayers than others. We ask you, dear Lord, to bless this food. In your name we pray. Amen. 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 And you were referring so, to... So, uh, how do you like your new town, Sydney? Oh, well, um, you know those old black and white films that we see on TV? Mm -hmm. Well... They're years ahead of this town. <laughs> Kids, uh, you've got to love them, then. <laughs> yeah, right? No meat, right? Right. Ooh. You make new friends, honey. You've only been in this school for two weeks. You, you must make this experience a, a positive one. Grandma, hmm? this place is so not me. Yeah. People here are nice. Dad, please. Willie. Sorry. Honey, you're still gonna try out for the cheerleading team, though, aren't you? Well, yeah, I guess. I mean, I was good when we were living back in L.A., so... Hey, it's a good place to meet people, especially the boys. You're new here, Pumpkin, and it just takes time. Remember, the mountain didn't come to Mohammed. Mohammed had to go to the mountain. <laughs> Your grandmother's right for a change. You gotta go after what you want, sweetheart. Right for a change? Oh, my bad. Your grandmother's right for the first time in her life. 
Listen, Mr. Thinks he's so hip. You're such a fool. Well, it takes one to know one. I don't know how they put up with you. Well, I don't know how they put up with you. I'll get it. I don't know why I even bothered to show up here. I knew you would be nothing but trouble. But believe me, if I had known you were coming, trust me, I wouldn't have. Talk to the hand. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I cannot believe you are leaving them to watch us. What's wrong with that, honey? They hate each other. Willie, they do not hate each other. We had no idea this was going to happen. Aunt Jen wasn't due for, like, three more weeks. She's never been early for anything before. Oh, I guess we better hide the kitchen knives. Look, I... I promised your Aunt Jen that I would be there for the birth of her baby. Now, we did the best that we could. I'm... I'm sorry. Baby, you seen my, uh... Yeah, second uh... drawer. Now, where'd I put my eye cream? Honey, don't forget your sinus medicine. Now, what else? Oh, yeah. I need my deodorant. Oh, hey, hey Dad. Nails. I gotta get nails. Dad. I'll show me if I can do that on the plane. Why do you always jump when Monique says jump? Where I mean, if Mom was here... Hey, that is not she fair, huh? We've been over this time and time again. Hey, baby, look at me. When Mom died, it was the worst day in both of our lives. Mm -hmm. We've got to move on, huh? Monique is my wife now, and she is your stepmom, and she loves you. Yeah, but you never have time for me anymore. First day. It's always her. Oh, sure, you don't say that. Huh? We're only going to be in California for a couple of days. I'll tell you what. I promise you that uh, when I get back, we'll spend as much time as you want to spend together. Promise? I promise. All right. All right. All right. I understand. But, I mean, if you guys are only going for a few days, then why is Monique packing a month's supply of shoes? <sighs> just heard from the Tries Trio Jazz Quartet. And right about now, I'm bringing you into a midnight hour. Hope you sit back, relax, enjoy the music, and have a wonderful evening.
guys. You're gonna miss your flight. Yeah, I can't believe that mom isn't up yet. You know, I think I'm gonna go wake her. No, 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 son, no. I got everything under control. Let her sleep. For the whole 10 days, if I'm lucky. Down, Catherine. Calm yourself down. You're, you're dreaming. That's it. That's it. You're asleep. Just wake yourself up. Yeah. Okay. Now, I'll just look back in the mirror, and and this time, I'll be. Yes, officer. You know what the speed limit is around here? Uh, no. No, I can't say that I do, uh... All right, when busy. you see some ID, give me your driver's license. Good. Cool. 
this your car? No, no, no. This uh, it's my son's car. I just dropped him and the missus off at the airport. All right, step out of the vehicle. Put your hands in the air. Is this one of them speeding traps? Now. Yes, sir. Drop your keys, slowly. Look, officer, couldn't you just give me a speeding ticket? It's a lot more serious than a speeding ticket, pal. Where's the guy you stole this car from? Look, this car is not stolen. I told you it is my son's car. Yeah. And it's pretty obvious that... Back off! Freeze! I didn't tell you to move, punk! We're gonna get to the bottom of this. I sure hope so. You stay right here, and don't move a muscle. Yeah, this is Officer Ratto. I'll deal with you code three. I got a situation here. I want you to run a license for me. Miracle. Yeah, I'm having a problem with a kid. 17 years old. I'm going crazy. Jerk. Well, I got him in a speeding thing. Yeah. And car's not registered. As far as I can see. Just a minute. Hey! Hey! Banging. I mean, you're real good. Thank you. Excuse me. You're the new girl, aren't you? Yeah. Well, you've certainly got a lot of potential. Maybe with a little more practice. Practice. Who knows? I don't. It was a very good first try, though. Maybe next time? All righty, I'm sure we'll see each other around school. Who's next? Kim? Kim Anderson? Yeah, yeah. Kim Anderson? Coming. I got nervous. Next? Ash, I don't get it. What didn't you like about it? I smell an attitude problem, major. Yeah, so do I. <sighs> Next! Yeah. I saw what happened. You cool? Oh, man. Well, if it's worth anything, I thought you was all that. Seriously. I think Ashley made a mistake. She's my sister. I'm gonna talk to her right look, now. Look, look, I don't need your help, okay? I can take care of myself. You know what my coach is always telling me? He says you're only a loser when you give up. I don't think you're a loser. Why would you want to do that? You're real good. Yeah? Yeah. Well, obviously not good enough. Look, I'm sorry, I... Hey, baby, you miss daddy? 
Listen, we got to stop meeting like this because uh, people are starting to talk. Oh my God. Yeah, it's right. So girl, I know you needs me, but uh, I'm a real busy right now. You know what, you need help. Yo, keep it down, girl, no broadcasting. You, there, you got a sister? Sydney. Y'all should be at school. Good morning, Mother Kai. Today's announcement includes follow-up to our decision. Uh, the following day, please report to the Christmas Office for disciplinary no, action. Uh, David Bailey. So what's up? You trying to get down? Uh, down? No. I I'm not down. Well, I, I am a tad bit upset. You would be too if you were having the morning I was having. Shut up. Shut up. Are you dissing me? Uh-huh, she dissing you, girl. Serious this. Look, I know you, you, you probably had a, a rough day. You, you probably failed the English test or something. <laughs> you want some of this? Okay, now, young lady, that is enough. Nobody puts their hands on me. You should be ashamed of yourself. All y'all. Instead of focusing on your study, something that can make your pathetic life worth something, you around here acting like some common criminal. I know your mother did not work her butt off so you can go to school acting like this every day. Now, I am in the middle of emergency, and the next time I see you, you better be acting like the young lady I know you can be, instead of some hoodlum. You understand? child. You need to go home and thank the Lord your mommy and daddy haven't kicked you out of your house. Looking like the devil himself. You need some help. Oh, sugar, honey, iced tea, not again. <laughs> when the kids get so fun. This sounds like something my grandma would say. Sydney? Grandma? Something's happened. Oh, this is big. Who the? It's me, Grandma Cat. What? I can't believe it myself, but here I am. Wait, I... Oh. oh my gosh. Oh. oh. Hurry up! Why are you late? Just get in the car, okay? What's up with you? Just get in the car. I cannot tell you about that right now. Who's the freak in the front seat? Don't you call me a freak just because something weird happened to me. I'm your grandmother, boy. Grandma? Did I stutter? Grandma Cat? What happened to you? You look like Sid. Yeah, well, guess what, Mr. Scientist? We know that. Stop it. Tell us something we don't know, OK? Oh, wow, Grandma. Have you been in my stuff? Of course not. Oh, wow, Sydney. We got to hurry up and get home so I can run some tests on Grandma. No wrinkles? If you touch me one more time, I swear I'm going to slap you upside your head. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe you left the brother out to drive. Well, see, what happened was, I was going to go from behind Yo, and get I don't a jump your on fables. the brother. Judas, man, you should have been sticking in now. Hey, dude, watch out! Whoa! Damn. Oh, boy wrecked my ride. Yo, man, you all right? Yeah, I'm cool, I'm cool. But this guy needs some crazy medicine. Yo, let's see if we can get him up and bring him over to the store. Got it. Right. <laughs> Good afternoon, young 
lady your parents at home? Uh, no. They're away on a trip, officer. Grandma? Can you turn that down, please? <laughs> Can I help you with anything? Uh, you have any adult supervision around here? That would be me. <sighs> You're her twin. Her twin? Twin. I'm her grandma. My twin. <laughs> Such a kidder. I stopped a young kid this morning driving a Ford Explorer, registered to a Barry Donovan at this address. Dad's car? Is Barry okay? Well, we'll know better when we find a kid who was driving. Maybe he can shed some light on things. Kid? Yeah, about your age. He was carrying this driver's license. Wait a minute. What did this kid look like? About six foot, wearing gray slacks, gray trench coat, black fedora with a red feather on the side, you know him? That's your grandfather. Grandpa? Grandpa? Mm. Mm. Yo, check it. Mr. I'ma go 50 in a 20 zone is coming too. Word. Oh. Oh. What happened? What happened? What ha oh, what happened? I can't remember what happened, Leo. I don't know. Let's see. What happened? Oh, I remember what happened. You knocked me flat on my back, sucker. I did? Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. Where oh, you coming from? Dang. I saw what happened. Are you OK? Is there something yeah. I could get you? Yeah, um. Where's your well, well, well. If it isn't Little Miss Gold Digger. Now look. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Come on now, young fella. There's no way to be talking to a lady. Young fella. There's no way to be talking to a lady. Spare ribs, macaroni and cheese, and jalapeno mashed potatoes. <laughs> um, <clears throat> Grandma, aren't you overdoing it? <laughs> well, that's what we're about to find out. See, these are the foods I used to eat when I was young. Man, I haven't had spicy food like this in 10 years. I haven't had dairy products in five. Lactose and dogs. all the prescriptions and lotions that you use. There doesn't seem to be anything that could have caused your transformation. Now think. Did you use any bit of this soap? <laughs> Wait. Soap? Great, Einstein. What do you want us to do? Take a bath? Well, if that's the soap in the bathroom, I used it. Sid, would you just listen to me for a sec? All right, I just don't believe it. You're gonna have to explain it. This bar of soap was in the box that my chemicals spilled all over yesterday. We'll have to run some tests to see if it's contaminated. Yesterday, I put it in the grandparents' bathroom. So, Grandpa must have taken a shower this morning using the same soap. Maybe when the chemicals mixed, created some type of fountain of youth effect. Chemicals got in their bloodstream and instant teenage grandparents. No indigestion? No upset tummy? Can you reverse the process? I don't know. I just figured out how it probably happened. All right, all right, all right. Just do your best, okay? And just do it before Monique and Dad get home. Wait. Does this mean I'm not grounded from my lab equipment anymore? Willie, I'm giving you permission to use whatever you need, okay? Just be careful and hurry. Cool. Funny guy, Mr. Funny Man in a hat. Yeah. Uh, hold on, hold on. Yo, that dude's got game. It's a female magnet. Yo, I think we got to be rolling with him. I hear that. I sure hope Grandpa's okay. Well, I'm sure he's fine. Just don't expect him to come around here anytime soon. Why not? Because he's selfish and irresponsible. And if he's 17 again, he's going to want to do it all over. No strings attached. Listen, new guy, you stick with us because uh, we are the serious players up in this one. Serious. Serious players. Play. Word up. We'll, we'll turn you into a Mac Daddy lover just like us. <laughs> yeah, what you say? 
Well, I, Come on! I don't know about all that now. What a deal. You all... Uh, you live around here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. See, Gypsy, it's just another bath. See, I'm gonna get you all clean. Good You look great, Graham. Aw, thanks, baby. Can I ask you a question? Anything, baby. All right. Um, what happened with you and Grandpa? <sighs> well... Well... You mean why we divorce? Yeah. I mean, Grandpa, he's so, he's so young and he's so fun and, and so hip. Your grandfather's a fool. Well, then why did you marry him? Well, he wasn't always that way. He was a, a good husband. Faithful. A good provider. Then what happened? I don't know. But enough about me, Sydney. I mean, you're young. You have a great life. You live in a wonderful town. Why do you hate it so much? I just do, Grandma. I mean, I had such a great life in L.A. I mean, there's so many people and, and everyone there, they're, they're so alive, you know what I mean? Everyone's so boring here. Everything and everyone? There isn't one thing you find the least bit interesting? No. Welcome to Casa Dei Terrence. Hey, okay, now, uh, who are your parents? My parents, I don't, uh, working, I think, paying the bills, you know. Mm. You lying, man. I thought you said they were on vacation, like in the motherland or something. Man, I don't know. Maybe they're upstairs. Why are you bugging me? Hey, uh, where's where your telephone? Telephone, yeah, right, right there. Help All yourself. Right. All right. I love your house, man. You always got food. Yo, straight up, my parents is providers. So, did you see how many phone numbers I scored today at the mall? Huh? Huh, you mean Gene scored. And did you see how the honeys was peeping me? Hmm. You mean peeping G now? Look, they was only peeping Gene because he was hanging with us. Check this. The honeys see us teaching Gene, and they wrote that. <clears throat> so, if we hang with him, we could have all the honeys in the world. All the honey. Like a buffet. Like a buffet. That's what I'm talking about. Mm. So what you say? <laughs> so what you say? I don't know, man. It's like... But you know I'm down. You kidding me? Bam! You a genius. We gonna be banging. We be you know what I'm saying? You're a genius. Yeah. All right. What? So, where you staying at? Well, I was going to stay at my family's house. But looks like I'm going to have to stay at the Holiday Hut. The, the Holiday, Holiday Hut? No, 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 brother. 
Why stay at the hotel, eh? When you can chill right here with the fellas. That sounds like a plan. Yeah. That's what it's I'm talking plan. about. Yeah. Gypsy! Gypsy, it worked! You're a puppy! See, I told you I wouldn't do anything to hurt you. <laughs> Work. Willie, I'm going to school. Who's puppy? It's Gypsy. See, I needed a test subject so I could see how to reverse <laughs> the aging process. And it worked. All right, I'm counting on you, Willie. Now, I'm letting you stay home from school today, but you have got to change Grandpa and Grandma before Monique and Dad get home. All right? Okay. Be careful. Mwah. Bye, Gypsy! Gypsy, we got a lot of work to do. Let's get to it. There you go. This is very upsetting, Todd. I really think you overreact. Really? Yes. I am days away from putting on the first major dance of the senior year, and you tell me the DJ that you scheduled has suddenly pulled out? I am class president, class icon, monarch high it girl. For God's sakes, you know that. Now, if you would just listen to me for one second, the I can... The dances that I've put on for the past three years have become the stuff of legend. This senior high class dance must be the, the pinnacle of my high school career. That's why me and you are gonna strut ourselves down to the Orange Club. We're gonna check out that new local DJ because I hear the boy can spin. So you don't have to worry about it because your brother got it covered. Well, why didn't you say so? So, Todd, who are you taking to the dance? I don't know. I just gotta think of Sydney Donovan. She's cute. Whoa. Rewind. Same question, new answer, please. Same answer, Sydney. Todd, what? no. I cannot have my brother dating the new girl. Okay, now you totally lost me. What's wrong with Sydney Donovan? Uh, she doesn't fit in. Plus, she hangs with that loser girl. <laughs> you talking about Julie? You know her name. Yes, I do. <laughs> Plus, you don't even know this, Sydney. You just met her. That's the exact reason why I'm taking the Orange Club tonight, OK? Honey, buddy, let me tell you something, OK? You may be my big sister and all, but you got to learn to stay out of my business. I still love you, though. Go on, Yeah. I don't think this is a good idea. I'm young again, Sydney. I wanna, I wanna experience life. Lisa told me Willie really find out how to turn me back. Yeah, but how am I going to explain you? Look, tell people that Oprah helped you find your long lost cousin. I love me that Oprah. Remember that time that woman sucked that other woman? I mean, it was crazy. And it was crazy. Wait a minute, that was, that was Jerry Spring and not Oprah. All right, all right, all right, all right. But I gotta warn you. Okay, school's probably a lot different than how you remember it. Oh, honey, please. It's still reading and writing and arithmetic. How much gonna change? This is a condom. <laughs> it's a latex condom. And we place it over the head of the fully erect, turgid penis. Oh. We roll the condom down the shaft all the way down to the base. <laughs> now, upon withdrawal, Holding on to the base of the condom, we easily slide it off like this. All right, class? Now it's your turn. <gasps> Shh. How do you turn this thing on? Oh. What's that? Oh. I'm fine. Oh, it's a computer. But it was talking to me, so I answered back. Nice. Uh. 
I break it up. Let me see what you got, player. All right. All right. Uh, uh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Who is that? Y'all kids think this rap stuff is new, you fool. Been doing this before you tied your shoe. Uh, new is old and old is new. And what y'all call new, I already been through. Uh, he is hot. Oh, he certainly is. Whatever floats your boat. Uh, you messed with Gina and that's all she wrote. Wow. That's all she wrote. Excuse me. This right here, y'all gotta show you money if you wanna get some more of this right here. Yo, that's my boy. Like that. Yeah. Hi, I'm Ashley. Great performance. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm Gene. Uh, some friends of ours are going to the Orange Club tonight to listen to some bands. I was hoping you'd like to join us. Oh, we're gonna have to check our calendar, girl, but I'm sure it'll be just fine. <clears throat> it's not an open invitation, geek. You're talking to me? Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm gonna sit right back there. Gene? <gasps> Oh my gosh. Grandpa? Gene? Well, um. Yo, my man. Gotta make this move right here. I mean, it's a major hottie, you know. I do it myself, but yeah, you know, I'm gonna hook you up. Oh, you know what? I gotta get to class. Um, can I trust you to get Grandpa Gene and meet you back at the house after school? Yeah, 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 sure. I got this under control. Okay. You just go to class. So you go do your thing. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Great. And you know, listen. Gene! Sydney! No. Cat. Blow away. We're busy. We'll go get busy with some other fool girl. Because I need to talk to this one. That's what I'm talking about. Excuse me, yeah, child. I'll get out of your way, girl. I didn't know what happened to you too. It was the soap we washed with. It got contaminated from the chemicals in Willie's lab. You would have known that if you would have called home. Well, hey, cat, cat, look, 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 you know what? Hey, you know what? I, I was planning on doing that. But, you know? Well, Willie's working on a way to get us back normal. What? Why? I like things just the way they are. What? Cat, look at us, cat. We are 17 years old again. Look at this. Oh, Lord. Hey, hey, feel that. I don't want to feel nothing. Aren't you at least a bit concerned with what's happened to you? Hey, I am 17 years old again, OK? I don't care how it happened. I I'm just glad it did. There might be side effects, Gene. We don't even know how long this will last. Hey, which is why. I'm going to ride this thing out as long as I can. I, I mean, why should I waste my energy trying try to turn back into a 67-year-old man? Constantly, constantly being remi reminded of my age with every step that I take. You know what that is? What? Booty. Booty? Booty. Will you listen to yourself? Who are you trying to fool? We don't fit in with this generation, Gene. And I don't care how young you look or talk, you will never fit in. Oh, oh you, you, you know why? You know why I haven't been home, Cat? There's your answer, right there. You know what? This is really sad. <laughs> you finally look the way you've acted your entire life. 17 years old. Well, I'm going to stay 17 years old. You old woman? Fine by me. You old man. Do what you want to do. I am going to do what I want to do. And you know what? I don't need your permission to do it. Like to go out with me tonight. Look, there's this place, it's called the Orange Club, and they got like all these DJs and gonna check out. I'd love to go out with you, young man. Would you now? <laughs> well, all right then. Look, I'm gonna see you tonight. 
I'm feeling good, brother. You can't even catch what you Boom. can't see. Look at that. Hey, fly to that Look at it. hey fellas. Hey, 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 fellas. Right Yo, homie. Belly. Hey, you know you got a big one. Get off me. Get off me. Oh. My, 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 my dog pound. What's up? What's up, y'all? Hey. Hey. Come on, come on. Move, baby. Stick your move. Too slow. You too slow. If y'all want to, you know, get get out the house, maybe. Go do a little something. Oh, come on, man. Messing on my combo. Yo, what's up, G? Man, is, is this all y'all gonna do? You ain't got it. Huh? You know, you play video games and, and watch music videos? Uh, other than chasing hotties, what else is there? What else is there? Come on, fatty. I'm man, there's, there's, there's fatty. life out there, man. The, 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 the pulsing, beautiful, unexplored, delicious life. I'm gonna out that down, door, man. waiting for you to taste it. Hey, I'm off for some grub. How about some taco hell? Nah, 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 Domino's, dude. They deliver. Chew that, chew that. Oh. Hey, come on, look at that. Come oh, on. Cheap shot is the one. Uh, man, lose the front lines, dude. You got a date with a hottie tonight. So what's the problem? Hey, pause, man. Stop cheating, man. Yeah. Dang. Got a date with a 17-year-old. Hot. <laughs> Game's over, man. I won, man. Alright, well, I didn't want to play you, so that means you guys. So, what happened at school today? I missed one day, and I feel like everything's changed. The stars are aligning, Sydney. I'm telling you, the universe is in flux. Tell me about it. Yeah, I mean, what's wrong with you? Your voice is generating unstable biorhythms. I don't know. It's just that my grandmother, right? She came into town, and I'm just trying to get used Ooh. to the changes that we're going through. You know what? I better go. It looks like my grandmother needs my help. So, am I gonna see you at the orange room tonight? Well, I don't know. Well, Tom will be there. Yeah, and so will a lot of other local boys. You know what? I have to go, okay? I'll just talk to you later. Bye. <sighs> Psychic Friends Hotline. No, Dion Work is not here. Thank you. You look great, Graham. I do look good, don't I? Mm, I can't believe it. I'm finally going on a date. Me. <laughs> Relax, Grandma, and it ain't no thing. Well, maybe it ain't no thing to you. But if the last time you went on a date was to see the new singing sensation Nat King Cole, trust me, baby, it is a fang. <laughs> Whatever. Ooh, big mama. <laughs> look <laughs> at you. Now, you look fabulous. Thank you. I have arrived. Now, if your grandfather can have fun, why shouldn't I? <laughs> you know, Grandma, I cannot believe I'm saying this, but you have become one of my best friends. Well, let's just hope you feel the same way once I'm an old woman again. <laughs> <laughs> That's my date. Ooh, right on time. That's a good sign, Grandma. So, which monarch high guy is lucky enough to be going out with my 67-year-old Grandma, huh? Todd? Sydney, how you doing? <gasps> oh my god. What is he doing here? That's my date. No! Grandma, no, no, Grandma, no, no. You can Of course I can't. No. Now look, I am not gonna toy with this 17-year-old boy's heart. Now move! No, no, Grandma, no. What? You like this boy. <sighs> Baby. No! Grandma, that's okay. That's no. Okay. No, it is not okay. Now, look, he obviously thinks I'm you. <sighs> All right. I'll go with him to the Orange Club now. Grandma! Hey, hey, hey. After you get dressed, you'll just hustle on over down to the Orange Club. And when the time is right, 
we'll make the switch. I cannot believe you. No, I am not gonna do that. Well, you got any better ideas? No. But I also don't have a dress that looks like that in my closet. But you do have something short, black, and clingy. Now put it on. Oh. And if he notices the difference between those two outfits, you had no chance with him anyway. Now what do y'all say? Audi 2000? No, we say one. Say one. One? Why is time one? One love. Well, I'll see you later, okay? Bye. Bye. Hi, Pat. You get dressed fast. Didn't I just see you in sweatshirt? And here it is, the hottest spot in town. Everybody's come down here, get the groove on, get a little, you know what I'm saying? Don't worry about Ash. Um, this is gonna be a lounge. Oh, hey! My gosh! <laughs> hey, Sydney! What are you doing here? I thought you said you weren't coming. When did I say that? An hour ago on the phone. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, here I am. There you are. It was great. <laughs> oh, man. So, hey, have you spotted him yet? Who? The man of your dreams. Yeah. Yeah? I think I have. Here we go. I forgot something you like. Todd. How you doing, Julie? Hello. What brings you out this evening? I'm here with her. Oh, you're here together? Mm hmm. Oh, you're here with, oh, Sydney. <laughs> I, and I, I, I couldn't quite figure out what it was at first, but then I realized, holy cow. You know, I said, that's it. That's oh, well, spot. well, well. If it isn't the loser, sisters. Sydney? Guess again, lover boy. Cat. <clears throat> What are you doing here? Just ignore her like I'm trying to do. What am I doing here? What are you doing here with her? He's my date. I mean, just how well do you know her? Did you go to school with her before you came here? Oh, yeah, we've been to the same school. The school of holy matrimony. You know what? You're not only desperate, you're psycho. Excuse me, <laughs> hey, hey, you heard me. Okay, hey, hey. That is enough. Come on, baby. Let's go. Can you keep up? My toes eye to arrow. The thoughts from my glance. That leaves them in a trance. My voice tone alone. We lose to a dance. The tactics that I use. Chicks be feeling me. Hitting that number for feel prophecy. Some try to copy. It's soft like a cactus. See we be true. Ballers. No need for us to practice. No walking. Strictly for the club is right here. We watch the let loose. Cause damage. Up in your ear. Grab a short. Get naughty. Enjoy the party.
Cat, hey, hey, Cat, Cat, that boy do something to you? Leave me alone, Gene. Cat, hey, Cat, Cat, just, can you talk to me for one minute, please? We have nothing to talk about. I think we do. Look, why don't you just go back to your date, okay? M maybe I don't want to. At least let me help you find Sydney. I said leave me alone, Gene. Um, I'm not sure. Where's that music coming from? Hmm. Maybe she's in here. affected her DNA and totally reversed her cellular structure. Just like with our grandparents. The band's got the joint jumping, baby. Everything is everything. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Back the boogie, say up jumps the boogie to the rhythm of the boogie to be. Can't you see, can't you see, can't you see? Right here, right now is the place to be. Grandma, Grandpa, and Gypsy have dosages of 15 different lethal chemicals in their systems. Is rocking, ain't no one flower inside. Since Gypsy is a dog, toxic chemicals affected her sooner. I've got to find the cure soon, or else Gypsy's dead. Oh. Everything is everything. <laughs> Just see right here, right now is the place to be. Ain't no need to worry about yesterday. Just make a feeling for tomorrow. song they're playing. Of course. It's our song. Okay, okay. come on now, baby. Don't, don't cry. 
You're gonna ruin your makeup. You look so beautiful tonight. Oh, you mean because I'm young, Jean? No. No, no. The truth is, I... I always think you look beautiful. You were right, Kat. I mean, I... I just been fooling myself. You know, just... pretending to be something that I'm not. God, I... I miss you, woman. I miss you. This isn't real. This isn't real. Sure it is. Kat! I, I love you. I know. You've always loved young, new, and exciting things, Gene. Cap, for as long as you have known me. Is that what you think? Just like you loved that job in Australia. Cat, that, that was over 20 years ago. For you, it was over 20 years ago. But I have lived with that job in Australia every day of my life. I was worried about you, Grandma. Todd has called like 15 times. Oh. And you know, by the last call, he figured you ran off with Grandpa Jean and just left him at the Orange Club. Look, a lot of stuff has happened. Look, to I'm me. not finished, Grandma. See, um, Todd thinks you're me. Okay, which pretty much blows the small chance that I have ever had at dating him. You know, I really want to be mad at you, Grandma, but I can't. Oh, baby, I'm sorry. Look, I know what you're going through. What makes you think you understand, huh? Because you've been 17 for two whole days? I was 17 once before, young lady. Yeah, a long time ago, Grandma. You don't know what it's like living today. Trying to be as as pretty or, or as thin as these, these models in these magazines or as hip as these women in these music videos are trying to live in this stupid town filled with stupid little people. No, you don't understand, Grandma. You don't understand anything. Uh, okay, you're right. You're right, Sydney. I, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have assumed that I knew what was going on inside of you. Yeah, Grandma, like that means anything now. I know you're sorry. You're always sorry. And you know what? You always say things you don't mean. And you know, I, Grandma, I have to say this. I really do. You chase Grandpa away. And you know what? Now you're chasing Todd away from me. <sighs> Don't worry, Gyps. I'm not giving up on you. The answer's gotta be in here somewhere. Hey! New girl! <laughs> I don't know what that was all about last night, but if you and Jean had something going on at your previous school, which I find very hard to believe, it's over. Over. Look, the rules of this school is that my men are off limits. That includes my brother, Todd. Loser girl knows that, and now you do too. 
You've been warned. What is her problem? Yeah, and my name's Julie. You know, just like an MPGIS chick. What the heck is that? Most popular girl in school. <laughs> to the dance tonight, because if you don't, Ashley will think she won. Yeah, but I'm not thinking about Ashley. But you're thinking about Todd. Oh, you guys had such a good time last night, and, well, right up until you ran out, but... Julie, I have to tell you something, okay? Can I trust you? Yes. Okay, listen. My little brother accidentally made a formula that makes people young, and my grandparents got exposed to it. We see now they're our age, and that was my grandmother last night, who looked exactly like me when she was my age, but now she is my age, so she looks like my twin. That's who ran out with Todd last night, because she was trying to make my grandpa Jean jealous while making out with Todd, only I ran in and saw everything, and now we're not speaking to each other. What? <sighs> Oprah helped me find my long-lost cousin, and she was the one who ran into the club last night with Todd. Not me. Oh. Oh. Well, why did you just say that? Jeez. Gosh, you know, oh my goodness. I, what are you gonna do now? I don't know. I just have to, you know, get my head together. <sighs> Julie? Yeah, J that's my name. You guys are tw identical. That's uncanny. I, mean, I don't even need my tarot cards to tell me that. <laughs> well, I think you guys need to talk, and I'm gonna go, so can you lock up for me? No, no, Julie, I... Thank you. <sighs> Sydney, what? You know, I spent the entire day sitting in the park thinking about you. Please. And you're right. I did chase your grandfather away. It was all because of this, this job and of all places, Australia. Your grandfather wanted to go so bad. But I was afraid. New people, new places. I was afraid of a change, but I, I couldn't tell him he couldn't go. So? I told him he could go alone and that I'd follow him. And did you? No. I never intended to. But I convinced myself that if he loved me, he'd come back. The next thing I know, I'm, I'm filing for a divorce, something that I have always regretted. I'm sorry, Grandma. I, it's I didn't. Okay. You still love him, don't you? Very much. Well, Grandma, why don't you just tell him? I, that's what I intended to do. But Sydney, everybody's afraid of new places. I'm not afraid. Oh, girl, please. You sound like somebody I used to know a long time ago. Someone who let fear and pride keep them from the one they loved. You remember that time I told you to make this new experience a positive one? I'm afraid I haven't been taking my own advice. Yeah, but Grandma, this, this is different, is it? Baby, don't make the same dumb mistake I did. Now, if you like this boy, you better tell him. How? At the <sighs> dance tonight. <sighs> now, let's go get our men. Come on, 
Gypsy. Oh, I, I got mad love for myself. I just want to jump back and kiss myself. Look at that. Yo, mm. Can you say any growth? Can you say any growth? <laughs> Whatever, yo. I just want to get more high. Me and you. Look at me, baby. Please, guy, you got to ask? I'm balling. I'm balling. Look at this. Player. You fronting, guy. Player. Please. Hey. Play. Play. Oh, my. Oh, my. Why? Why? My Please, man. go ahead, brother. You're doing too much, my brother. Dude, what's with this hat? You look like, you know, you're from the 1800s or I don't know what. Look, guys. I, I, I've been thinking. You know, um, this life, it, it's not for me. But I, I want to thank you guys, you know, for, for helping me out been fun. Dude, come on. Lose these frown lines, will you? We're your boys, for real. Together forever. Ta -da. Ta -da. Hey, 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 hey. I I'm never gonna forget about you two. Well, how could you? Look at us. Come on. True that, true that. So, my man, what are you saying? You leaving? I mean, you can't bail on us now. We need you for the hotties to stick around. That's true, we do need you, bro. Look, fellas, life is not all about the hotties. You know, maybe when you're young, it is. And when you're young, youth is fine. But there's nothing wrong with growing up. Understand? Oh, come on, man, come on. Please, man. Don't go. Hotties, hotties, hotties. Three of us, we could get something together. You heard what I said, okay? I gotta get out of here. Y'all take care of yourselves, all right? Take care of yourselves. Yeah, yeah, whatever, whatever. Man. Your man got problems. I mean, what the heck did he mean? It ain't all about the hotties. It's all about the hotties. True that. Bam! That's what I'm talking about. Jibs, you're OK. Come on, Jibs. We got to hurry up and get to the school so we can save Grandma. Come on, Gypsy. Now, if you just take off that silly hat, everything would be perfect. Look, I'm sorry, Ashley, but this is the new me. Oh, well, it won't be when I'm through. Looking for someone? No. <clears throat> Listen, Jean, you know, the only reason that I brought you is because there's no one else here at our level. So I'm warning you. If the new girl shows up, stay away from her. Date with you last night, or no? You had a date with me. I'm her cousin, Cat. Look, I'm so sorry I fooled you that way. I was just trying to make somebody jealous. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Where do you think you're going? Ashley, 
I'm sorry. Oh. Hi, Grandpa. Hey, baby. You look gorgeous. Thanks. Right, I'm tired. Out of my way. Look, Cat, we have to talk. And I'm not taking no for an answer. No is the furthest thing from my mind. Maybe you could um explain this to me over a dance. I'd love to. You would. Okay. Yeah. You know what I've been thinking about all day? What? Australia. Look, I'm sorry about last night. No, no, no. It, it, you were right. I mean, I, I've been selfish over the years. I'm only thinking about myself. I should have come home. Instead of giving you that divorce. No. I shouldn't have asked for one. I'm sorry. I'll let you get away, woman. I've had to live without you for 20 years. I'm gonna let you know something. I'm never letting you go again. Neither am I. Okay. Oh. I feel like a 67 year old woman. Cat? Oh my god, Cat. Cat, hey, hey, baby, hey, hey, somebody get some help. Get some help. Let me call 911. Is she reading it? Hey, come on, talk to me. Somebody, hey, what would you do? Go get some help. Why are you? guys, back up. Grandma, are you okay? Sid, look, I got the antidote right here. You need to get her in a tub of some type of water right away. The pool, the pool, come on, let's go. Oh, Where? Come on. come on, let's go, let's go. Where do you think you're going? No one walks out on me. Hey, Ashley, this is not the time. Yes, it is. Move, or you'll what? Oh! Come on, come on, let's go. Come on. What do we do now? Um, here. Okay, I'm gonna throw this in. Okay, now they have to jump in. See, it's the only way. Whoa, whoa. What's happening? Willie. Willie found a cure. This is it. We gotta go. You gonna come with me this time? Okay.
<laughs> well, what are we supposed to do? Start a parade? <laughs> Ooh, go on, stop it, you old fool. You go ahead. Right <laughs> Mom, uh, Dad, are you guys OK? Yeah, everything's yeah, fine. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> we have got to let your parents watch the kids more often. Dad, they named the baby Brett. <laughs> Brett? Uh, well, what happened to Jean? I like the name Jean. And I love the name Catherine. Mm. <laughs> hey, uh, honey, uh, what's been going on since uh, we left? Uh, can you fill me in? Huh? Life, Dad. Uh, Just <clears throat> life. Everybody, I have an announcement to make. How would you feel about a wedding in the spring? Oh, sugar, honey, iced tea, Jean Donovan. <laughs> Are you saying what I think you're saying? Will you marry me again? Oh, Jean, I, I can't think of anything I'd rather do than spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> oh, congratulations. Oh. OK, I have got to plan this whole wedding. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna have to call um, Reverend Smith and the, and the floors on 34th, and uh, Darlene is gonna have to do your dress. Oh, you're gonna look so beautiful and white. White? Right. Peach? Peach is good. Yes, much better. <laughs> um, Monique, um, I have an idea. Why don't I help you with the wedding plans? I know you. Oh, Sydney, <laughs> I'd love that. <laughs> Upstairs and unpack. Oh, okay. <laughs> Your son is in shock. Boy is out. <laughs> <laughs> See? Yeah. You know what it's all about. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Is it Todd? Wait, can you hold on for a second? Thank you. It's for Dad. Dad! Telephone! Take a message. Dad, no! I can't think too much about tomorrow. The past is done and gone away. But there was one thing that I'm certain of. I want to start my life with you again today.
from out of nowhere Like the speed of light Hot pain, hot pain, yeah Can I see you tonight? 